Bonjour, Monsieur Balde. Bonjour, Madame. <laughs> um, I wanted to ask you a few questions about Tabaski. D'accord. Um, my first question is, um, what does Tabaski mean to you? Uh, for me, Tabaski is a, a moment of celebration. It's a moment of connecting, getting together with family members, share good food, laugh, and, uh, and just talk. Yeah. Okay. What was your first Tabaski? Oh, excuse me. What is your favorite Tabaski memory that you can think of? Uh, I don't remember exactly when, but this is a long time ago. Maybe I was in high school. Um, we, like me and my friends and I, we got together, put money, collected a lot of money. We bought a goat <laughs> that we took to the river. I remember this. Maybe I was in, I think, uh, my last year in high school. Um, we bought a goat, we went to the river, um, and then we celebrated by sorry, cooking, it, eating, hanging out, listening to music, dancing, and it was just a, it was a, it was a good time. Um, mm -hmm. It was a good time. Was this mm -hmm. college friends or high school? This is high, high school, school yeah, high school friends. Okay. Yeah, high school friends. Um, and now that you live here in the U.S. and, and, and you have um, a family of part U.S. and part Guinea, uh, how do you celebrate uh, Tabaski? Is it, is it different? Um, how does that work? Celebrating Tabaski here is, uh, for me anyway, it's very difficult um, for many reasons. Number one is to find a good time, find the time actually to go. This, mm -hmm. uh, this is of falling over the weekend, I think, on the 21st. Maybe it's not the weekend. But if it's on the weekend, I could go to the mosque and I could celebrate, I could hang out with my friends. But a lot of times, Muslim holidays fall on days that I'm at work, so I can't. And the other reason is, within Roseville, even my family, I am the only Muslim person in my family. So my in-laws and my wife are all non is uh, they're not Muslim. So it's hard to celebrate when we don't share much. So for me, Tabaski is um, getting together with family with the same ideology of uh, celebrating it, uh, Islam, but my, uh, unfortunately we don't. So mm -hmm. it's hard to celebrate mm -hmm. any Islamic holidays here, um, especially if I'm at work or um, I don't just don't have, I don't see uh, Muslim friends. Mm -hmm. So it's, it's hard. When was the last time you got to enjoy any Muslim holiday with fellows of your faith? Uh, this is, um, I want to say like five years ago when I was living in LA. There are a lot of Guineans that live in Los Angeles mm -hmm. and a lot of those that we hang out regularly. We used to meet once a month and we use, I mean, we meet once a month and we meet on all these uh, Islamic holidays where we celebrate when you see from 90 to 100 people with the same objective of celebrating Islam, celebrating Tabaski or celebrating Ramadan. So it was cool four years ago. Before that, it's actually when I went, when I was at home. Mm -hmm. I was in, in Guinea because the whole country is almost a Muslim. So it's, it's good to be in that energy, in that environment. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much, Mr. Uh, Bande. Absolutely. Thank you for your time. Thank you.